there were just thousands of people involved in the, the mural um, Treasures of Boone County. Stacy Self. I go by Wildy. Uh, I am an artist and an art educator and a mother of two. Um, locally here in Columbia, Missouri, uh, owner and operator of Wildy's World Art Center. So in the newspaper, my mother read that there would be a bicentennial celebration for Boone County and that was coming up and that the Boone County um, Bicentennial Committee was petitioning ideas to engage the community in um, something fun that would celebrate and commemorate this 200 year event. And uh, so I was like, well, I'm, Wiley's World's perfect for that. And actually at the same time I was contacting them, um, Nora Dietzel was contacting me to do a collaborative piece with her people with her team at work and she wanted a large scale piece for her office that would you know fulfill their needs mission vision and she said it would be great if you come to this meeting and i came to the bicentennial committee meeting the boone county stormers i became an honorary member that day and i said here's what i do i brought my powerpoint and showed them my the visuals on what is Wiley's role, what do we do, and what can it do for the community and your event. And so they just, like, they all raised their hand and said, yes, it's unanimous. We want to do this thing and we want to do it with Boone County. And then together right there, we conceived of the puzzle mural. So we decided that we would hold community meetings and um, have a town hall gathering. And I would ask the, I would present the, the project and then ask the folks, what are the beloved treasures of your community? You know, and, and we would look at the last 200 years and what really is crucial to this community. And those went into the design of each piece. We came up with the fact that eight different Co large communities in Boone County would do their own, would design and paint their own piece of the puzzle. And the puzzle was a giant, almost 30 foot tall map. Treasure map was what I wanted to do. I had to select the, the few pieces that, you know, all the things I could fit in. Basically whatever I could fit in, I would put in. I had lots of data, tons of research, and that's one thing I did not uh, foresee about this project. You know, I'm a muralist and I was, I'm not a, Bo I was not a Boone County native, so I didn't know a lot of the history. And I ended up diving deep into it. And I, that was just so, amazing and enriching in my life that I got to be a part of Boone history in a really deep way and learn so much about it. Now it hangs at the Boone County History and Culture Center. They had a 30 foot wall. So we figured out that was the only wall in interior wall big enough to show this piece. A, an amazing project, pretty much the pinnacle of my experience as an artist and muralist to date. Definitely very, very awesome project. 